Joe Ruggiero here at Team Third Law Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. Just letting you know that we're keeping a clean environment here for you at Team Third Law. As you can see, all the mats are turning them upside down, making sure the bottoms are all nice and clean for you guys. So you got a nice clean environment when you're training here at Team Third Law Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. Yeah, let's show them, let's show them how, you, uh, how you scrub the mats bottom. I'll scrub the mats. Yes, yeah, sir. Okay. How we go about this? Have a, a state of the art vacuum cleaner. State of the art scrubber. Start scrubbing, baby. Scrubbing so the school is clean, right, Joey? Yep. Gotta make it clean, you know. Very good. So the club is, it smells like flowers now, right? Oh yeah. Like mango. Mango, yeah. Yeah, very, very good. <laughs> um, how many? How, how long are we gonna stay here cleaning? Probably till one or two in the morning. You know, make sure you get it done, so that way you know you guys have a clean environment to train in. Like I said, this is a bit, this is a one time, once a month. That project that we do here at Third Law is one of those dirty jobs, but it has to be done because infrastructure and clean place is very important. And also, because it's very good to go to a place that smells like mangoes when you come in <laughs> or vanilla. What's last time we did mango? What, what scent should we do now? Uh, I'll stick with mango. You like mango? Yeah. All right, that's good. I like orange. We might try orange. All right. All right, guys. You know, we started the cleaning, and now we're scrubbing the floors. Making sure everything is real clean, mats are upside down, then we're going to flip them and scrub them all over again. Everything smells delicious here. We're going to get some pine saw, pie solution, and the other station we have Michael Eastman scrubbing mats. Okay. This is how he's earning his sponsorship <laughs> to the net. That would be trials. Mike, how, how, how is the scrubbing mat business going? It's not that bad, it's good, right? <laughs> Those mats are, we're leaving them clean, guys. Clean for your camp over here. Do more mopping. Camp uh, also going to the Dhabi trials. First tournament. First tournament as a blue belt, right, Campo? Yes, sir. You're going to go kick some butt, right? Just give it all. Excellent, that's what I like to hear. So, yo, not only the best school in Florida, but the cleanest school as well. Third law. Throwing Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. Joy, finish with some good words here. Because if you have, you gotta have clean technique, clean mats, so you gotta have clean Jiu Jitsu. Beautiful Jiu Jitsu, right, Joy? A king de la Himagar. Put him. All right, guys, so we're halfway there, a little more than halfway done. Uh, actually, no, we're, we're one fourth of the way done because we got to flip them and scrub this mat again. Okay? Another little thing we want to use, okay, we use pine soap here. Well, this is a pine island, another brown of pine soap. But I should put a little bit of this with this type thing. Because it's going to leave this place, you know, like super clean, nice pine smell, very good, you know, so. It's very important as you come here, you train hard, you're sweating, you're working hard, so you have a comfortable training environment that's most like, you know, like home. It's, it's important, okay? So we're almost done. Keep you guys posted. We just get a little replies of pine, pine spot solution. Behind you, you're going to see we have a black and decker scrubber uh, that we use as well. Very good tool, you know. Third law is, a, you know, even when it comes to cleaning, third law is a high tech cleaning school, okay? Uh, but I really want to put this message because hygiene is also very important. You guys come back here. Come back here real quick. Go oh, sure. As you can see, you know, another thing that a lot of schools overlook, and, and we're talking about infrastructure, is something that I learned from uh, Coach Dan Gable in wrestling successfully. He says your school needs to have a nice infrastructure. We have a super large first aid kit, okay? Uh, gear box. You know, tape, band-aids, everything you can think about. Okay, a big first aid kit. You know, all our cleaning solutions, everything you need to, every, anything you need to keep the place nice and clean. So, uh, yeah, like, uh, I will keep putting more of these videos as we finish. The school's going to be like, sparkling after this. Okay, I'll see you guys in a sec. Alright guys, here we are. School back together. Joy giving it the final touches. Joy. How was today's cleaning session, sir? It's pretty good. It's pretty good, right? Oh, yeah. 
What do you think? How do, how do we melt? We decided to go with the orange, Joy. See, we have a little bit of uh, scent orange candles or uh, orange smells. We're going to be putting it all over the place. Look, and this is the funny thing. Joy, go with me. Hold the, hold the candle, sir. See, do a commercial. Citrus scent. Order of absorbing <laughs> gel. Natural magic. <laughs> Delicious. <laughs> Very good. Boom! And you probably get to see that even cleaning would take it seriously here. Is it all nighter? Okay? It's 7 a.m. in the morning. So at 8 30. We clean this mat underneath, upside down. It smells wonderful in here. Here I got the glazed bottle. I'm going to start spraying a little bit in here. Here, Joy. Have the pleasure. Let's spray around the room, Joy. Joy's running. Happy. Got a clean place. <laughs> Hey, you know, Joe is corny, man, but don't take it for granted, man. His jujitsu is sick, okay? You're going to see a lot of joint competition this year. Uh, so, guys, uh, there you go. We're just going to give a final touches. I just want you to, you know, rest assured you guys are training the cleanest school in the world, okay? I want obsessive composer on this. <laughs> you know me? I'm obsessive composer. We're scrubbing. Let me show you one of the tools that we use. We're using that. Screw it back there. I mean, yeah, but it smells good. It smells better than. Man, it smells good. <laughs> I almost got in trouble. I said, it smells better than my house, but I, oof. But, anyways, guys, until next time, bro, throw